Hello guys, welcome to online web tutor presented by Profotex Solutions team. I am Sanjay. This is our 20th part of WordPress plugin development tutorial from scratch. And in this video session guys, we are going to discuss about short codes in WordPress. So let's get it started. Go to administrator panel. First we log into our WP admin. So basically guys, what is sort codes in wordpress sort codes are nothing these are sort and operators you can say which represents the basic functionality of any function so basically two functions we can we will use while declaring or using our sort codes in wordpress first function we should use add sort code which basically takes two parameters for now first is sort code name and second one is the function name means the callback function which represents the firing action of this sort code and the second function if you want to use this sort code to php file directly that in in that condition we want to use do sort code method here is our sort code name within brick bracket but in that case in that case if you want to use this sort code directly to any wordpress pages then in that specific condition we don't need do sort code method okay guys so one by one we get started with sort codes in wordpress after after viewing the definition section of this by using add sort codes and do sort codes after watching them in action we will learn the definitions of these functions separately Me move that to use sort codes in WordPress, you just make a function which just you can may say callback function for that. If you want to use sort code, here is sort code. Suppose I want to give suppose custom plugin, and here is the callback function. Suppose custom plugin function, we okay guys. So before using this callback function we need to define this function function just paste it here and for now suppose it prints simple statement like hello online web tutor okay guys so when we use this sort code to any php file or any wordpress page then in, the, in that condition it actually fires custom plugin function and what custom plugin function does it just simply returns or prints a statement suppose hello online web tutor so let's we use in wordpress manual page just copy this sort code go to admin panel make a page Suppose click on add new demo sort code page, and here we need to paste the sort code of our custom sort code. Just copy of that and paste in this section within big bracket before using your sort code you just implement within you have to write your sort code within big bracket just click on publish we can see when we click on this page we can see our statement is here as we have written in our code hello online web tutor so this is the statement guys actually this function has printed and this function has actually fired from custom plugin okay so this is the basic use of add sort code method add sort code method basically it makes a custom sort code which binds a function and this function has returned a statement like hello online web tutor so in this is not a single statement we can write we also include suppose if you want to include some extra files 
to this sort code then we can do it here simple in simple way just make a file for that and file suppose we have written suppose hello for the solution team for providing providing good depths of WordPress and now I am to save this file views click on suppose salt code template salt code template dot php and now we are going to attach this file with our action hook of sort code here just we need to include file and include ones and here we have to write the path suppose it's plugin dir path just copy of that paste it here under views folder it's sort code template dot php file control s to save here we have attached php file to this sort code okay guys control s to save just click on refresh we can see here is the statement that we have written to our page so as we come to the definition section of sort code sort code is a basic sort and operator which basically fires or defines its callback function it reduces the code complexity as we know guys this is sort code we have used in this page not only this the, this one is the single page where we can use this sort code we can use it in several many many pages so this is code complexity it reduces the code complexity and it uses the redundancy of the code it reduces the code size and we have used this function many and many more okay so this situation i have shown you this is how we can use sort code to manual wordpress page suppose if you want to use this sort code to our php file suppose i want to this in all the all page dot php so how can we use this sort code to php page directly so just copy of that and here is the second method comes into play that is do sort code echo do sort code just copy within big bracket paste it here so do sort code method basically fires basically takes an argument as a sort code and it finds into the plugin pages that where it actually defines after finding the definition section it calls the callback function and returns the statement or returns whatever actually function contains okay guys so this is the plugin that we have attached so control us to save just click on custom plugin and this section of code has actually we attached with all page dot php so just go to all page main sub menu section click on all pages so this is the statement that we have written with our page so we have seen two different ways to use sort codes first we have seen into the manual entry into the wordpress page as we have embedded and second was in directly php files so do sort code method is a wordpress defined function which basically takes an argument as a sort code and it returns whatever the function contains if you go to the documentation section of ods add sort code and uh, as well as do sort code then you can find a good definition of these functions in great detail add sort code basically the first the first should be the tag and second one is the callback function as we have seen add sort code method contains first one is the tag and second one is the callback function we okay, guys and do sort code method it contains the content section as we can see content section is what content section is whatever we have written inside this function 
custom plugin is a soft code so it is the content section okay guys so in this video session we have seen the use of add sort code and do sort code method in later video session we will see more formats of sort codes in wordpress suppose we want to use parameterized sort codes or a sort code which contains basically a tag means there are some contains between tags so there are so several formats of sort code so how we view actually we use those formats in wordpress so we will see in later video session in great detail about those formats so all also guys if you want to see the documentation section of sort codes in wordpress then you can find several links on google that what is sort codes how we define sort code and what is the basic purpose of sort code so basically in sort codes you have to make, keep in your mind basically two functions first add sort code method is diff, is used to define the sort code and do sort code is used to actually use the sort code to any wordpress pages of php files okay guys so i think by the help of this video session i have explained each and every section of wordpress means wordpress sort codes in later video session we will see more advanced formats of sort codes so i hope you understood so if you understand this video session then don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel so for this video session guys thank you for watching have a great day